सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने 20 अगस्त को कोलकाता में ट्रेनी डॉक्टर की हुई जघन ने हत्या और रेप पर सुनवाई की आपको बता दें कि सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने इस जघन ने हत्या और रेप कांड का स्वतः संज्ञान लिया था चीफ जस्टिस डी वाई चंद्रचूड़ जस्टिस मनोज मिश्रा और जस्टिस जे बी पारदीवाला की बेंच ने इस मामले की सुनवाई की जाने माने वकील कपिल सिब्बल पश्चिम बंगाल सरकार की तरफ से पेश हुए उनकी बातें सुनकर लगा कि जैसे वो विक्टिम के खिलाफ और पश्चिम बंगाल सरकार की पक्ष में खड़े हुए हैं जरा सुनिए सुप्रीम कोर्ट में कैसे हुई बहस There are a couple of things. Mr. Sibyl, before we deal with the broader aspects of safety and what we propose to do, yes, I have something to assist on that, Mr. Newton. Uh, First, on measures of safety, we are deeply concerned about the fact that there is a virtual absence of safe conditions of work for young doctors across the country, particularly in public hospitals. So we know these are all young interns. There are residents, senior residents, doctors, and most importantly, women doctors yes. who are subject to of, of labour dangers and vulnerable. Yeah, vulnerable. Uh, by virtue of the nature of their uh, of because of gender. Working hours. Yes, working hours. Uh, most of the young doctors have to sit in somewhere. Thirty-six hours. Hour. Uh, we find that there are no uh, duty rooms available. No separate restrooms or duty rooms available for men and women doctors, for the other nursing staff, for the paramedical staff who are also uh, on duty, and therefore we must uh, evolve a national consensus to ensure that there must be a standard national protocol to ensure that safe conditions of work are provided. It is not a matter of providing protection either to women or protection to doctors in general. It's a matter of creating safe conditions of work, so that they ultimately, what is equality under the constitution all about? If women cannot go to a place of work and be safe, then we are denying them the basic conditions of equality. And therefore, we are entertaining this, and I'll very shortly share the way we want to uh, proceed with this to ensure that ultimately, uh, it's not that every time that there is a rape or murder that the conscience of the nation is uh, awakened. We have to do something right here and now to ensure that these conditions of safety are uh, maintained in terms of protocols which will not just be on paper, but protocols yes. which will be enforced across uh, across uh, across India. Now, in so far as what happened in Kolkata is concerned, there are a couple of things from what we have. Of course, first let me begin by saying that we are deeply concerned of the fact that the name of Uh, the deceased who was assaulted and murdered. The name has been published all over the media. Photographs have been yes. all over the media. Video, claw, video clips, obviously, either before or after the postmortem, have been published, right. uh, showing a body. Uh, you know, after she was subjected to it, extremely uh, concerning. We are. We 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 are the first to recognize the right to free speech, but there are well settled parameters. It is extremely painful. I agree entirely with you. Which have been laid down in now the uh, the, the, the new criminal the, the, the new criminal procedure code. Yeah. Now judgments of our court, in it would say now that you will not publish the names of the survivors of sexual assault. Correct. In this case, the person. It's a criminal. Was, we have filed 50 FIRs in that count. 50 FIRs. And because I believe that nobody should publish. The Majesty inform your lordships before the police reached, photos were taken, and these were circulated. We didn't allow anything to happen. We cordoned off the area. This is this is the way we provide dignity and this terrible right of uh, an individual who has lost her life as yes. a young doctor. Yes. But apart from that, uh, Mrs. Isabella, I think that you are here for the state of uh, West Bengal. A couple of uh, important, quite a couple, quite a few uh, aspects of the. Or the way the matter proceeded, it appears that the crime was detected in the early hours of the morning. Yes. yes. No After the crime was detected in the early hours of the morning, the principal of the hospital tries to pass this off 
as a suicide. Not true, not true, not true. Not true. The parents are not the parents are not allowed to see the yes. body. The parents are not allowed to see the body. No, Mother, this is, I'm sorry. Anyway, Mother, this no, is the impression. We'll, we'll, have to, we'll, have to, we'll have to place the facts before your Lordship. So we have it's investigated that. that. This is not correct. That, uh, so, mm -hmm. Until late night, we find that no attire no was there. That's also not correct. Not correct. What time was the FI register? Mothers, in fact, we did, did what is called a, what we call, call a duty case, mother. Duty case. Unnatural death case registered. Yes, unnatural death case registered. Yes. But Immediately. That's, right. that's an FIR, mother. That's an FIR. What's the word to discover? Duty case can not be FIR registered properly in the police. Mother's inquest was done and then FIR registered immediately and the investigation but started. What it should have been done? The FIR registered. Uh, like 12 minutes, 12.30. Does the FIR say that this is a case of a murder? No. Yes, yes. I no, no, wait. No, no, no. no, no. And that's your guess. We have some nature in that. What? Inquest shows it's a case of murder, mother. Inquest shows it's a case of murder. Inquest is done. The, uh, the postmortem is, the autopsy is conducted. Yes. Now, until the night, no FIR indicating that this is a clear case of a murder has been made out. It has, mother. I'm sorry. I'll place those facts before you. It has been, mother. Lord, may I suggest? From Lord, may I suggest? We registered the case Lord, of murder. We caught the victim. He is a civic worker, mother. It's an individual act. I show all that to your lordship. And that's the first aspect. Yes. What was the principal doing? Why did he not one? Why was this kind of inaction on the part first an attempt to pass this off as a suicide instead of a murder? I'm sorry, mother. That's not correct. Not recording. Not registering an FIR. Till late in the evening, her, the body itself is handed over to the parents sometime in the evening for cremation. Fourth, and that's a matter of very serious concern. On the next day, the doctors, the doctors, because they are all doctors working with her, the doctors are on protest. A group of persons, a mob assembles at the hospital. The hospital is invaded. And the critical facilities are damaged in the morning or whenever the, the mob enters. What is the police doing? Yes. Yes. Mother, we have videos for all. Mother, let me first of all state. Mr. Simon, the police Mother, Mother. A, a very serious offense is taken, has taken place. The crime scene is within the presence of the hospital. Now, that is the first thing that the police have to do, namely to protect the crime scene. What are they doing? Allow, allow vandals to enter the hospital. Uh, it's impossible yeah. that 7,000 uh, uh, people can enter without the consent. Allow me. 7,000 people can never gather without no, knowledge or no. consent of the police. This is not an adversarial litigation. It's not. Therefore, let us not be in no. denial mode. One girl has lost life by not only you know, the sexual pervert, he is an animal. Sir. After the principal resigns from this medical college, he is sent to another office. He is appointed as a principal of another college. He doesn't resign. But anyway, be that is, be that is, but the principal's conduct and the least his conduct is under scrutiny and he is appointed as a principal somewhere else. No, this is all. We have a note no, on this missing. No, it's no, not separate. But each other is a report on the reality. Just show it to you. Let him file report. No, but I just show it to you. Tomorrow, a couple of things which you would like to hear. Well, let's make it very clear. Yeah. We would want the, the investigation has been handed over to the yeah. Bureau of Investigation. Yeah. Done. Yes. We want CBI to file a status report before this court on Thursday. Correct. We will take up the case on Thursday. We want CBI to advise us on the status of the investigation. Correct. The investigation obviously must be at a very sensitive stage so that it's something which will be submitted to the court. So the, for court's consent, not to the, the case guide. There will be an investigation yes, status yes. report which will be given to us on Thursday. We will uh, consider the status report on Thursday morning and see what yes. where the investigation is, uh, is proceeding. Today what we intend to do is that today we intend to pass an order. Uh, what we have done is, and few of us, that's why we were, in, uh, we were in conversation with each other, we have discussed the pros and cons. We are setting up under the authority of this court a national task force. The national task force will consist of a diverse segment of doctors from different parts of the country. We want them to make us recommendations in regard to the 
modalities to be followed across India. We are not only talking of the Adhikar Medical College and Hospital, but modalities to be followed all over the country for ensuring safety at the workplace first and foremost. For which our young doctors, our middle level, the middle level doctors, the senior doctors are all uh, today on process and on strike. At the same time, we would now that we are taking charge of these proceedings, we are appointing a national task force. It's our earnest request to doctors all over the country who have stuck work. There are institutions that I know appointments are taken two years in advance. For it's the All India Institute of Medical Sciences. Appointments are taken two years in advance. If patients lose their slot, they go back by another two years. So we would really earnestly appeal to all the doctors that we are here to ensure that you know their safety and protection is a matter of the highest national concern. And therefore, this is something which we would uh, earnestly, earnestly appeal to all the young doctors that this is something please trust us. That's why we have not left it to just the High Court. The High Court, of course, consists of very seasoned uh, judges that Chief Justice was monitoring the investigation by the CBI. But we felt that this is now not a matter of a particular uh, offence, however serious and horrendous the offence is, but something which affects the institution of healthcare and India. Therefore, the need for the Supreme Court. We welcome this. I think this must be done, Mullahs. All of us must be very positive. <laughs> but yeah, but Mullahs, I have only one request. Mullahs, I have only one request. Sorry. Lord, I, I need one or five minutes on this one. Yes. Who is the first informant? We were talking about the first information. Yes. Who is that first informant? Can you name us, please? Name him. Who is the first informant to just watch the affair? The one I just find out. And we would also like to know the time of the registration of the The father of the black woman. The first UD case was done by the police on its own. So that is not an FIR. What is section 174 of the old CRPC today? Can anyone assist us, please? Yes. So that's just a report. Yes, to start the investigation. Then to lodge the FIR. One is the father of the deceased? Yes. The vice principal of the hospital. Was the father of the deceased a vice principal of the hospital? Oh, there cannot be two FIRs. Uh, no, 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 but both what? complaints were sent to us. No. Both complaints sent to us. Just tell us, tell us whose complaint is treated as father, 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 father of the deceased. This is uh, registered at what time? Yeah, that's when 11.45 p.m. 11.45 p.m. Okay. Now, next day, next day. Yes, yes, the night. The night. In the night. In the night, in the night, in the night. When is the when is the body? When, one second. When is the body? When is the body handed over to the parents for cremation? Well, let's kindly have a this note that I've given. What time is the body handed over to the parents for cremation? One second. Around three thirty. Thirty then. Uh, no. Therefore, therefore, one thing is very clear: the body is handed over to the parents for cremation at eight thirty p.m. The the FIR is registered at 11.45 p.m. three hours and 15 minutes after the body is handed over to the parents of the family. Oh, they refuse to file. Well, this is the problem. We handed it over. They filed the FIR. They made the complaint at 11.45. They say, we are in shock. Please do whatever you want to do. They wanted a post-mortem. We did the post-mortem. All is videographed. Everything is videographed. The autopsy and the post-mortem take place. Between 1.45 to 4 p.m. Now, between 1.45 and 4 p.m., yeah, okay. the autopsy takes place followed by the... One of the autopsy took place at 6 o'clock, not at... Fair enough. That's all right. We take it as 1 between 1 and 4 o'clock. Okay. It doesn't take place in 1 minute. It's a, it takes okay. over... Takes one, one, video one second. Don't keep on interrupting. They wanted so a we, board. We, we constituted a board. We are proceeding on the basis of Mr. Sibyl's hypothesis that the autopsy and the post-mortem take place between 1 and 4.45 in the afternoon. Now, no, the there is no, no, the that autopsy would reveal that this is a case where a, where a doctor has been murdered, where she has been murdered. The FIR is registered at 11.45 in the night, Mr. Sibyl? Yes. Who was expected to register? Yes. Nobody in the hospital registers the FIR? No, the no, mother registers the What was the principal, the vice principal? What were the authorities of the hospital doing? 
they wanted a board, we constituted a board, they wanted a magistrate, we got the magistrate. You don't need a medical board for registration of FIR. You have the moment at the moment, Malas, what are we considering? We are considering, Malas, two or three things, as your Lordship has put to me. How did these photographs reach the social media? No, no, I'll mention all this. How did these photographs reach the media? We have nothing to do with it. Let us not realize everything. People there took photographs, came in, took photographs and sent it. Number two, Malad, number two, immediately, Malad, immediately an unnatural death case, case Malad, was started and an investigation was started. Your Lordship may be right, Malad, why did it happen? But whatever the parents were doing, we were agreeing with that. We set up a board, we asked the magistrate, a judicial magistrate to be present. Everything was videographed, everything was called. Mr. Sibra, it is the was made before the of the hospital. Parents are not present in the hospital when the murder takes place. Yes. It's the obligation of the authorities of the hospital to register an FIR the moment they get up. 45 done. The letter was sent. 11.45 in the No, no, 2.45 letter was sent. But since then, superintendent sent a letter of, of at 2.45, Mother. It not, it is not 11.30, at 2.45 itself, it, that we will set out all this, Mother. It's better we set it. What we, uh, well, the Lordship will give me five minutes, Mother, yes. to further, Mother, to assist your Lordship. Yes. Yes. Lord, first of all, Lord, let us not trivialize on this side, my Lord, we are dealing with one incident, but your Lordships are rightly looking at a larger picture. But we are dealing with, my Lord, a young doctor, uh, not only raped, Sex by a sexual pervert or perverts, but who was an animal like instinct, who had an animal like instinct, the way Malod, the body was handled. Thereafter, Malod, I don't wish Malod, to make this a political issue. I would request the state also not to be in a denial mode. Three hours of the patient, parents waiting, Malod, is something we can experience if we put ourselves in that position. Now, Malod, so far as the safety is concerned, Lord, one thing I must bring to your Lordship's notice. Lord, the doctors are genuinely, my Lord, have a grievance. They are, my Lord, they have lost their one of their colleagues, my Lord, globally. But, Lord, out of my Lord, all states, 23 states have legislations dealing with, my Lord, what is called for, my Lord, Kerala, my Lord, uh, so and so medical, Medicare service persons and medical service institutions Prevention of Violence and Damage or Loss to the Property Act. There are, Malod, I will give Malod, the list of acts. Malod, uh, this also the National Task Force Malod, can... Uh, uh, go, the punishment is provided... It's a cognizable, my lord, and... Uh, three years. Three years. Three years. Yeah, yes, three years. Yes, it's uh, cognizable, non billable and punishment is three years. Malod, this is first. I will not place it. The National Task Force, Malod, which our lordships contemplate, can not go into this can even make suggestions and it should be welcome. Lord. Lord, second thing Lord, which is worrying us is this. Lord, even in a well organized function, if we want the presence of 500 people in an auditorium, we all know we have to make efforts. 7000 people at the middle of the night armed with lathis and hockeys Lord, can never be without the knowledge if not consent of the police force. It's complete failure of law and order throughout yeah, the entire state. What time did the vandalization of the hospital take place? Lord, midnight. Midnight. It, it's at midnight, my Lord. As I thought my learned friend, he doesn't want to politicize the matter, my Lord. Why are you saying all this? Now, now, let's, now let's, why this is, my Lord, important? We should be called upon. We'll tell you what happened. Mr. Solicitor, what we do is that we... We'll one more ask. One more ask. Lord, uh, and, and my Lord, again, my learned friend may feel that this is, my Lord, but this is directly related to the issue in question. My Lord, the West Bengal has an in charge DIG. In charge? In charge DIG, Director General of Police, uh, who is already being charged and being con my Lord, considered by your Lordships for having fabricated or otherwise dealt with the evidence in Sharda's scam case. Calcutta Police doesn't come under DGP. Why are you saying all this? Calcutta Police is an in charge DGP. Let someone else be the This is what is happening. Let them choose. But not the man who is already This is the kind of misinformation we are having. This is nothing to do with this. Only a minute.
रियालिटी No, share it with all of us. We will share it. Don't worry. No, no. no. Kolkata police informed the family members of the present case of suicide. False. Another, another, false. Another aspect. At no time did the police get this information. See what we propose. We we have indicated that 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 Power of the state of West Bengal be unleashed on peaceful protesters. Well, I I give to your I give. We have right. videos. We have the videos of all that, that happened. People who are people, whether they are doctors, civil society, lawyers, people who are protesting. So long as there is no act of destruction, of we people, have videos. We agree. Let there not be the power of the state unleashed. Agree. On Peaceful protest. Manas, I agree, Pritchard, and that has not no, happened. No. One second. We have videos which we have placed, which we placed before your lordship. Likewise, and Manas, what happens is like political parties get into the act, and this is what happens. People, people who are taking to the media to communicate their views, yes. that is deal with them with a great deal of. I agree. I agree. It's a time. It's a time of national catharsis. Look at the girl. Lost in the girl. Because now, for example, they say Pelvi can collarbone was broken. False. Post mortem doesn't say that. Not just state in the center. Then the CBI. CBI is investigating it. Yes. We will ask for a report from the CBI. Now what we what we propose to do? Just one second. This must stop. We are we are in charge of the proceeding. We have heard Mr. Solicitor. We have heard Mr. Sibyl. If we start hearing all the interveners, there will be no end to it. Please have some patience. We are going to now tell you what we are proposing to do. We are not disposing of the case, but this allows to at least. Renounce what we intend to do. All right. So this is the uh, list of okay. acts. Would you not suggest this for a minute? Or all right. आपने सुप्रीम कोर्ट की लाइव स्ट्रीमिंग देखी आपको बता दें कि सुप्रीम कोर्ट ने इसके बाद अपनी बात कही कोर्ट ने डॉक्टरों की सुरक्षा के लिए नेशनल टास्क फोर्स के गठन का ऐलान किया अब इस मामले की सुनवाई 22 अगस्त को होगी